This, everybody, is the inner workings of the Cranes group chat, and I'm just going to scroll through for you all to see the inner workings of this chat. We're scrolling. It's a long chat. Jeez, lots of bullying going on here, as you can see. I'm just going to be sorry if D finds it. What? He's been after for D for a while. What? This guy is just the cranes. They, um, you'll see their names and stuff here as you go up here. Keep going. This is so long. It just goes back so long. I'm going to have to make this into multiple videos, I think. Because, holy shit, it's such a long chat. They harass people for fucking hours every single day. Every day. Multiple people. It's absolutely insane.
Wowzers, how many fucking people do they harass? That's insane. The chats are so fucking vulgar. It's absolutely ridiculous. I don't even want to click on images anymore. Uh, you never know what you're going to see over here. Oh my god. Uh, the hell? Oh my god. They've been like doing this all day. Oh my god. This is just one day. And we got like months of this. I've got months worth of this. I don't know why they were so stupid to act this way and, like, be stupid enough to put me in there. Um, I, they don't realize they put me in there, though, this is the problem. Like, I guess, but... <laughs> either way, uh... I'm pretty fucking outrageous. I'm going to bed, but I just wanted y'all to know that Dwani's a bitch. That was, I think, that Jennifer, um, what's her face, girl? be from when they're picking on Donnie. Shit. Some of these images, oh my god. It's, it's, oh. Alicia Mortimer. Oh. Rest in peace is <laughs> she Audi's mug. Oh wow. Okay, so see this guys, look at this. Look at, oh, they've got screenshots of here. Oh, that's from Rebecca Crane right there. A prank calls someone a troll bitch. Oh, jeez. So they put Carol's number out there. Oh, see, look at this shit. I need more details. I want to go buck on this one. Oh, who's that one? I wonder if that voice is recognizable. Let's play it again just to so. I need more details. I want to go buck on this one. I want to go back on this one. There it is, Jennifer Suzanne. That's who that was. Oh my god, some of this stuff is so disgusting. Who's that? Uh, who's 
that? Titus, they're picking on Titus. The Shady Bunch. There's so much stuff in here, it's crazy. Wow. Go eat a dick, you fucking whore. Who's that? Go eat a dick, you fucking whore. Oh. See who that, I don't recognize that voice. Yet, anyway. Doesn't take long to figure that stuff out. It's so easy to find stuff out these days. Like, it just kind of lands in my lap. Oh, shit. They're fucking gross. They are so vulgar and so nasty. Oh, my God. <laughs> Who acts this? I guess they do. But, like, fuck. What the fuck? Catfish coolie. Okay, so my girlfriend got this divorce. So she and her husband sold the house. So she had to put all of her stuff into storage. And the stuff was in storage for like almost a year because she rented an apartment. So anyways, we went to go help her move out and move it because she bought a new house. Um, and nobody had been to her storage unit in like eight or nine months. And one of her kids put a loaf of Publix bread in, like when we were taking stuff out, we found a loaf of Publix bread. Y'all, it was still white. It was a little hard, but like it had so many preservatives in it. It was still normal. So I gave her 17 year old son $5 to eat two slices of it and he did. Whoa, that's nasty. You just admitted to fucking feeding somebody food that could have, like, hurt them? What a nasty woman that Jennifer Suzanne is. Ew. Ew. Mm. I don't like this shit. This is nastiness. How do people behave like this? I just don't get it. Oh, my God. What the hell? Dear gosh. What is this? 
What's happening here? What is all of this stuff? I'm learning about, and this Christina Mello one seems to have a bigger role too. What in the hell? These are some names. We got Hala Yellow, that's a Facebook profile. Joshua Hochelle, Jeff Jeffers, James Theodore, Jonathan C. Carlisle, Mark Anthony Buono Payne, and Henry Fowler. Four. All real profiles on Facebook. Because they changed their names in here once they got in. But those are the real names. Look at that chat. Oh, gee, Jesus Christ. What a... Wait, I could never... What words to use? Jeez. This is insanity. I am still, like, fucking shocked by some of this stuff. Oh, my God. Ah. <laughs> Yikes. Oh my god, Brandon Willoughby. Who's that? CJ Hall. Rebecca Crane, notice that, Rebecca Crane. I like how her tits land perfectly on the fucking answer and hang up button. Oh, they're talking about that lady they were making fun of. Harassing this poor lady. Oh, I see my name. Hold up, he's saying someone made a five hour documentary live on him. Oh yes, they did, it was crazy. J. It hit. And this is just like, this isn't even back to the beginning. There's so much, so much more. So much more. Now we're getting into the stuff about me. Let's see what these things are. Just this week. I okay, guess there's a lot of harassment in one week. Wowzers. Internal light inside of them. So 
I don't give a fuck if you don't agree with it and say negative, no, blah, blah, blah. But um, cognitively speaking, as spiritual beings, uh, yes, everybody has. It just might not be equal or similar to yours. It could be damaged. Uh, it could be faulty. But everybody has something inside them that is that factor. Right. <laughs> Six five in a truck. What's up? If he's got work boots and nice tight jeans, double what's up, baby. And a fact: everyone is born with an internal knowing, an internal drive, whatever you would like to call it. Everyone is born with an internal light inside of them. So I don't give a fuck if you don't agree with it and say negative. No, nope, blah blah blah. But um, cognitively speaking, as spiritual beings, uh, yes, everybody has. It's just you got hypocrite motherfuckers. And you got people in this group, and whatever. You got. I guess you guys been talking about this for a while. Air that shit out. Get to the fucking bottom of it. Other than that, isn't shit's not going to change if there's not a discussion. There's a number of people that do not comprise a moral compass. See, we got to stop. We got to stop that narrative right there. Because there are people who are out of their goddamn brains, right? And they don't know, they don't have any lines in which they won't cross. Okay? And just like what Chris just said, she just treats people how, how she wants to be treated. Mm-hmm. And when these motherfuckers are out there treating people in a certain manner... And they get treated treated the same way? Yeah. Can't really argue that. You know? Even in the case of debtors. Shit person. Real life people all the time. You got real life on some shit. Where the fuck is that Nancy bitch? Because I have questions. Like, ugh. Ugh. Let's see, this is why I don't eat. This is why I don't eat people's food. Everyone thinks I'm rude, but I'm not. Your shit person doing shit to people? And then you get shitted on? <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> like I said, that fucking, um, that chomo from last week, I hope he gets his ass beat for the rest of his natural days. In front of his mama, his grandma, I don't give two fucks. You know? I don't get nothing about that dude. I hope for his natural days, he, 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 he gets embarrassed, he gets the shit beat out of him, and personal opinion, death penalty. That's just me, though. You know? I cannot have any sympathy or empathy for those who have little to none for others. I just will not. And when somebody decides to push back on their asses and shit happens to them, oh well. That's the only thing I'm going to say about that one. The same thing with you, Titus. Everybody be fucking with you, too. You got real life, too, bitch, and it's because you're a nasty human. There are hundreds and almost even thousands of people that sit around talking shit about you constantly. You're almost more hated than I am in all communities, not just my community. And uh, you want to talk about shitty things that people do to people. Well, let's talk about the fucking shitty things that you do to everybody constantly, Titus. And the fact that people have taken it to your real life too, bitch. Five times, actually, to be a fucking fact. So, yeah, shitty people have shitty things done to them. Just like that you, the shitty fucking human, had shitty things done to you, Titus, bitch. And I didn't even give that fucking drink to my dogs. The shit wasn't in the freaking trash. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and he put, like, garlic in his shit. Yeah, he had, like, products out there about to kill animals and shit. Mm-hmm. Hell, they eating that shit. And it wasn't suitable for freaking canine consumption. I think everybody has a moral compass. It's like your inner knowing. Um, and what you do is wrong or right. Like, I straight up... Yeah, but I had all kinds of shit done to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I'm not freaking sitting here and saying some shit like it didn't happen to me. Yeah. But have food ever been sent sent um, sent to my home where I ate and shit like that? Fuck no. I know I ordered some shit in which I would never fucking eat, like Freedom Beard's fucking jerky. Mm, hell nah. Ain't interesting that. Well, Jennifer, even on the pedo hunter side. That motherfucker sent a pizza to my home. 
a Craigslist ads, washer and refrigerator, exactly. strangers coming up to my home, all kinds of shit. What I was just my saying. Home, Aaron Bray's, you know. Because you're yeah. a shitty person, yeah, like you said. Shitty people have years. shitty things done to them, just like that, bitch. Like you just proved it. Years. <laughs> you know. Years. And then whenever I you hit deserve back it, on the bitch. You definitely who deserve it. it. Then people are like, oh my god, kids live there. I'm like, well, kids live where I, you know, where I live too, so. What are you guys saying? And then I always fact check them, put the person's actions out there and their words and statements and what they've done, and compare them to freaking mine. I'm like, okay, tip for fucking tap, bitches. Dilly dilly. Now, about those semen cakes. Well, Jennifer, even on a pedo hunter's side. Anyways, I don't feel shit for freaking dinners. <laughs> I had to stop. Well, Titus, the topic has come up several times in Swagger, and I don't give a fuck about D, so I don't have a dog in this fight, and ain't nobody throwing the moral book at me, because I, by and large, am not a piece of shit, so there's that, and I wasn't talking directly to you, I was talking to the group that when something happens or somebody does a troll like like pizzas or or whatever we've often had debates where people sit on opposite sides of the fence but that doesn't mean uh we have to get in a fight about it so because i don't give a fuck um i think shitting in fudge is a scumbag low life obsessed mental illness check yourself before you wreck yourself look at what you're fucking doing move but it's not my issue and i can't tell people and i anyway i got cut off i can't tell people and i won't tell people how to troll mm-hmm. yeah there are services where yeah, you can get animal poop sent to people now no, uh, Pee-wee. Sending poop and then having the person ingest it are two different things. Because I believe there's an actual service online and which you can um, which you can subscribe to, and they'll send dog poop and other kind of poop to a person's door. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there are services where yeah, you can get animal poop sent to people. Now, putting animal poop in various different food products and having a person ingest it, that's yeah, an entire, entirely different argument. Mm, I haven't seen this topic come. It's the first time I've seen it. This is my stance on everything. You get back what you put out in life. You get what you get and you don't throw a fit. I'm the only person talking. So that will lead me to believe that all commentary is directed towards me. Unless it's directed towards somebody else, and then put them out. Like, yo, you did this shit, now you believe in this shit, and yada, yada, yada. That's hypocrisy. And now, when it comes over to my side of the house, when you're a racist fuck, yeah, you can eat shit. I don't give a fuck how nasty anyone thinks it is. You can eat shit. Especially when you went on big, bad, and racist on me. You can eat all the shit fucking sandwiches, all the shit brownies, all the I shit never went fucking big, cookies. bad, you racist on you, you fucking because liar. Because a lot of brave men and women of all colors and fucking creeds have died to end this shit. We had an entire country who, rect who ratified uh, various different um, amendments. Oh, is it nasty as fuck? Oh, yes, indeedy. That's why I don't eat everybody's cooking. You need to define what real life he means because the shit in which he does. But even with these scamming, uh, that's real lifing people. I've not scammed anybody.
was fucking with their finances. I've never ever scammed anybody. Never fucked with no one's finances. Not accounts. once. Real life ever. Ever. All this other shit that he does. Real life in people. I've never real lifed anybody. Titus. You, know, people that got some shit that's you lying. How face bitch. You wait, bitch. I'm taking up the offensive against Mr. Fucking Fuckface Titus Cooper. You listen up, bitch. You're on notice by D motherfucking ditters that gets ten times the attention than you do, bitch. You're on notice, hunty.